what's up guys so checking out all my bashirs here all my senegalis bashirs this right here is the standard normal colored bashir um those are the ones you're going to find at PetSmart. these are the ones that are going to be most available um they're like a gray color to them with a white on the underside um this is an albino cynical bashir so red eyes and this is the short fin variety um Red eyes, they've got a slightly yellow kind of hue to them. Um, and you'll see there's the long fin counterpart. So yellow body, red eyes, that's the albino Senegalis Bashir. Now this is the long fin albino Senegalis Bashir. So much longer fins, much flowier tail. If you're gonna keep this variety, I would recommend you keep them on their own or with very, very peaceful fish, because those fins can get tattered really easily just from running them around like on that wood and stuff that's in there. So he gets a little bit tattered up, but still a very beautiful fish. So long fin albino cynical Bashir, much more rare. And then you have the tank boss in this tank. And this is a very, very large leucistic Senegalis Bashir. So they call it a leucistic or a platinum Senegalis. And this one happens to be a very, very eggy female. She is constantly full of eggs. She's huge. She eats a ridiculous amount of food. So the leucistic has a white body, especially when you compare it to an albino. You can see here that the albino is definitely a yellow color and that platinum when she doesn't look green because of the lights on the tank um, and the reflection from all the plants is basically flat white. Now she's got a spot on her head um, where she ran her head into the top and when it fixed itself it, she's got like a, a gray spot on her. Um, but the leucistics actually have black eyes, which is just stunning next to their white body. Her eyes are hypnotizing. And I absolutely love this fish. This fish is, oh, I just love you so much. So those are the different types of color morphs that you can find in Senegalis Bashirs. Um, when you're keeping Bashirs, you need to keep them somewhere between 78 and 82 degrees. They actually breed better. This is a breeding pair, so that normal colored one and the leucistic actually breed all the time. Um, if you're breeding them, you're going to want to keep them in hotter conditions. They like nice hot water when they're breeding. Um, you can feed them pretty much anything meaty. I usually feed mine Hikari's Massivore Delight. Today they're getting some blood worms, and she's obviously being picky about it. She keeps spitting them out. So I'm going to let you watch my Bashirs play, and you guys make sure you live your best life. See you later.